Quickly before we get into today's video, I wanted to thank Orate for sponsoring today's vlog. If you guys have been watching my channel, you know I've been working with Orate for like two, two and a half years now. I absolutely love their jewelry. I'm a huge fan of the quality of their jewelry for insanely good prices. I sleep in my Orate jewelry, I shower, I go in the ocean, like I do everything with it. This ring right here I've had for like two years now, still perfect condition. I have some of their um, earrings in. I love these studs. These right here, absolutely love. Sorry if you can hear builders next door, they're like working on the house next door But I also wanted to share a new piece that I recently just got from Orate This is the Orator chain and I'm literally obsessed with it To celebrate Orators around the world, Orate has designed a chain called the Orator chain Which has the AU logo So Orate women do a lot, they empower, inspire, create, lead all the good stuff, but most importantly, are aware of the impact they have on not only themselves, but the world around them. This necklace is made from 100% sustainable gold, which I absolutely love. Also, it's just such a good chain to layer. This is such a good layering piece, and also just to wear, like with the like what I have on right now. I love this so much. Ignore my broken nail. What I love most is that this reimagined gold chain is a big thank you to all Orate women for being on this journey with Orate. So check this out. I'll have this exact chain linked below. Also, in addition to their transparent pricing um, or it has now teamed up with accrue savings so if you have been eyeing a piece but you're not ready to like fully make the splurge on it quite yet accrue is a creditless way to save and then buy you just simply choose your product open your accrue savings account and make your first deposit then you can be on your way to saving and earning rewards which you can use towards your purchase so you guys can start saving for your or purchases with accrue now plus you will earn 10% in rewards for your purchases as you save so it's it's like a win-win for everybody. Plus you can get 20% off of your first Orate purchase if you go to oratenewyork.com slash Rachel and use my promo code Rachel. Again, that is A-U-R-A-T-E newyork.com slash Rachel. Also that is 20% off with no minimum spend, which is amazing. And this deal they don't really do often and it's for my listeners, subscribers, all of you guys exclusively. So again, it is oratenewyork.com slash Rachel, promo code Rachel and yeah, you'll see me wearing my pieces throughout this vlog. I always have like my rings and studs and things on like that. So I love their jewelry. So check them out, linked below. And thank you, Orate, for sponsoring today's video. Let's go ahead and get to the vlog. Hope you guys enjoy. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> Mom and I are in New York. We just got here. Um, I just ended off a travel and like a few days in Nashville vlog and now this is the New York vlog officially of the dress fitting. I'm so excited. We're about to go see the dress for the first time in a year. I, I bought the dress a year ago and now we're back for fittings. We're on Fifth Ave. We're going to Bridal Reflections. I just wanted to start off the video. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to vlog in the appointment because I don't want to show you guys the dress obviously quite yet. I want it to be a surprise but I'll try to maybe like blur it out or whatever. I'm going to try to get some clips but welcome back to the channel. It's so crazy because it feels like we, it's been so long, but it also feels like we were just here. Right now. Do you agree? Look at it, and also being back here makes yeah. me want to like try on more dresses. Picking up the goods. Snapchat, and then I'll get out of your way. <laughs> <laughs> Just got to the room and we wrapped up dress fitting day one. It went so good to put the dress back on. I was nervous that I was gonna kind of maybe like not love everything about it, but I think that I like it even more than when I tried it on because it was actually like my size and fit me very well. We're just like changing a few things on it. So we're gonna go back, not tomorrow, but Thursday and then Friday we pick up the dress. So. We're here for the next three nights. We're staying at the one hotel in Central Park. It's such a cute room, so I'm gonna do a little room tour. Um, you walk in 
right here really pretty shower I love I love their um, scents and stuff here too like the hotel this is my first time actually staying at the one but in LA we would go eat breakfast and stuff and the whole hotel it just smells so so good and I love like all the finishes the wood I feel like if I had a home I would love for like the bathroom and the stuff like to look like this it's really pretty so we've got bathroom here and then mom and I each have our own bed which is nice bed number one <laughs> bed number two mom's taking a photo of the oh wait this is good look at this pop some champagne they have an espresso machine mom yep. you'll love that I know and then this look at this little window bench I think my favorite is this window bench. and then I love this this is our, oh you can open it too but you guys I'm literally shocked at how chilly it is in New York right now but this is our little view it's really not good but it's okay but here's our room for the next three nights here we are oh i said i'd put mine over there but is that okay yeah and then if you want to lay yours flat and it can go underneath mine weighed 51 pounds i always go over and i literally pack i don't even overpack Actually, i'm surprised like what did you bring i don't know I like we didn't bring anything much um out for my birthday I know, I saw it was cute. I'm just gonna probably hang my coats up. Just these right here. I'm just hanging these three things up. Yeah, I'm hanging your stuff up. Throw up here what you want hung up. You're kidding. Why would you bring that? Does it look cute with one of my outfits? One of my outfits is just like a bra and it looked cute like hanging off my wow. shoulders. I was gonna wear it tonight. Well, you probably, it's kind of cold out. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm saying. You probably want to wear that. What else can I hang up for you? Okay, are you taping that? <laughs> <laughs> Don't walk that on right now. Where can I get good light? You guys, this hotel room's so like dark and moody. I feel like this whole vlog's going to be so dark. <laughs> but we're, dark. we just changed quick. We didn't do like any makeup or anything, but we just, I was literally in sweats. So I put on this little outfit. Um, I'll link all my clothes that I wear in this vlog down below. This jacket's from the Frankie shop. This little, oh, the bathroom might be better to show you guys. Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, this little bralette's from House of Harlow. I'm wearing just black Zara trousers. My bag is YSL and my sunglasses are YSL. And then my hoops are from The Perfect Tube. So we're gonna grab some dinner, walk around. We might go to, well, we are gonna go to Zara, try to get a photo. It's only like 5.30. It feels like it's 10 o'clock at night. Doesn't it, mom? Yeah. Show mom's outfit. Mom's silk top is from Tula Boutique. Super cute. Pants are from? Um, I think Forever 21, maybe. No, actually, Boutique in Port St. Joe. Bus. <laughs> mom, you sound like the girls on TikTok where they're like, where's your outfit from? They're like, this boutique from Alabama. This boutique from South Pole. No, Fuss from Port St. Joe. Super cute place if you ever go. Yeah, it is cute. Okay, let's go. I, I got my room key. Do you have yours? so tired and, and i'm so cold you guys we we walk into the room first off why is new york so freezing i'm literally wearing the biggest jacket and we walk into the hotel and it's 66 degrees and normally i keep my house at what do you keep the house at in florida 70 70 i keep it mine at 71 yeah. if the sun's really really out i'll go to 70 but um we walk in and it's 66 degrees. We're like both shivering. We're like, I'm like waiting for the room to warm up before I put my it's 90 at home. pajamas on. Yeah, Nashville yesterday when I was going to my workout, I remember looking at the car and it said 87 degrees. I did not even stay on the beach to go to the beach today because I couldn't even sit in the sun. It was so hot. Yeah, it's so, so, so cold hot. in New York. I don't think I could live here. Mom and I keep talking about it. Every time I like see someone who looks like they're like a local, I'm like, I just don't think I can live here. I think I can do it. I'm like, I need, I need a grocery store where I can drive my car, park in the parking lot, get my groceries. You are crazy. <laughs> yeah. Hey, man. But we just came home from dinner. We had um, dinner right on the corner. If you guys ever come and stay at the one, like the one street over, what would be the street, mom, that the dinner place is on? It was on 56th. 56th Street. It's called Rue 57. Really, really yummy. We actually came to that restaurant last year on the day of my birthday when we bought my dress so 
it was kind of fun. And, and we really like their food. And we really like their really food. Like the server. And we really like the server sit in the fr like first corner section. He's always there. <laughs> Oh and he's really nice and they have good sherbet so try it but we're gonna put pajamas on day one is a wrap day one is good <laughs> feet are already like killing me yeah. literally already killing me but we walked i feel like four walked, and a half miles today oh, we probably walked like six good thing i brought comfy shoes these yeah, sneakers you comfy brought? ones Oh, they weren't comfy. They were, but not when I put them on. I have my athletic I sneakers. On, I put them on at four o'clock this morning. These sneakers, you guys, I'm gonna link them. They're so good. I have them in the black, like the black V. Um, but I really like the white because they go with any outfit. I feel like this is like a basic sneaker. It's not like the most high-end, trendy fashion sneaker, but I love them. This is the one the free people won. Yeah. I've always wanted this pair. Remember? Oh yeah, I thought you wanted golden goose. I want those too. So if anybody has a free pair of Golden Goose <laughs> shoes, can you please send them my way? Yeah, but tomorrow will be fun. Tomorrow we actually aren't going to the dress fitting at all because it's taking them a whole day to like do. So today was the main alterations. Yeah. So tomorrow they're going to work on the dress all day and then we go back Thursday for final, any like touch ups or anything like that. And then Friday we take the dress home. So tomorrow our goal is to just kind of like relax, chill, hang out. And then um, I'm getting a lymphatic drainage massage from Tox, which is like half a mile walk. So I'm going to go there in the morning. I'm going to obviously bring you guys along. It's going to be in the vlog. And then our goal is to find mom a rehearsal dinner dress. So that's what's going on. But we'll see you guys in the morning. See in the morning. <laughs> There's no way. Mom, it says, to Mom, just try it. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, that's really. Mom, just take a sip for the vlog. <laughs> just do it, Mom. I, don't I really, know. I literally rinsed the cup out too. You did. Yeah, just do it. <laughs> Why is it that way? <laughs> just do it. <laughs> it's good. I know they say that it's that it's like but that because it's it mineral. Like I don't oh, know. Wait, I... wait, look at it. it's settling. Yeah, because all like the minerals. minerals and stuff. That's my vitamin D. <laughs> it's my vitamin D base. I just paid twenty dollars for this out of the hotel fridge. Is it good? That's good stuff. Oh God, it feels good. <laughs> good morning, New York. <laughs> you guys, it's like gross out. We're not in LA anymore. <laughs> Whenever we would wake up in LA and I would pull the curtains back, it would always be sunshine. Good morning, you guys. Literally just rolled out of bed and turned on my camera. I'm about to like brush my teeth and put on some clothes and go walk across the street. There's a Starbucks. It's um, like not really good weather, but I have a lymphatic drainage massage at 11 o'clock. And it's currently like 8.30. I have been editing a video. I stayed up late last night to get some work done. And I'm like wrapping it up this morning. And oh, I forgot to share with you guys. I'm wearing these new pajamas that I got. Or I guess it's like this little pajama set. I just recently got it's from the brand A Turn. And I found them through, I always see, I follow Hailey Bieber Bieber's closet and they always tag like her clothes and she always wears these and then Maggie had them on in LA and was like I can't believe you don't have those yet and they're so comfy I got them in I got the set in gray and then I also got the set in white I left the white at home because I'm saving them for the honeymoon but they're so comfy and cozy and my mom likes to keep the room freezing so <laughs> no 70 is not freezing <laughs> mom I literally woke up sick because the air blowing on me. I've been like that since I was little. I would go to hotel rooms and I would always get sick. Okay, come to the Thank you. I was gonna walk, my mom's back in the room. I was gonna walk to the Tox NYC, like a massage place, but I got too scared and I was like, I need to call an Uber. So I Ubered, so now I'm like early and they don't open till 11. I think I'm their first appointment. So I'm just waiting outside. I feel like I'm like so not a New Yorker, you guys. I'm like, what do I do? And it's like such gross weather, but I'm really excited. Hour massage and then I'm gonna probably Uber back to my mom. It was like a mile and a half walk and I was just like, 
it's rainy, it's cold, so I called an Uber. And I'll probably call an Uber back. Thank God I brought this jacket, you guys. I thought I would be crazy for bringing this, but it's freezing. restaurant what's this called I got the pesto spaghetti mom got ravioli mom yours looks yummy sauteed spinach we're sitting outside under these heaters it's really cute out here I know but like how do, how do you even pronounce it all right I'm gonna do a taste test mm. It's homemade pasta, I think. It's so and the flavoring in it is gonna be It's amazing. so yummy. Yeah. Ten out of ten. <laughs> funny I don't know why is it doing this what it's clumping because you put dry or new mascara over. can I just leave it yes it doesn't look bad the more you keep doing it it's getting worse hey, you guys it's oh <laughs> my god I can't right now put matt makeup on no mom. I'm not even a makeup person why are you talking why are you talking to me right now oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> this is a thrive <laughs> Do I look like I'm thriving? Woo! You guys, we're literally, we're literally going to Nobu at 9.45 <laughs> at night. They probably close at 10. They do not. I have something in my eye. Um, it's not. Okay, we, it's been a long day. I don't even think I picked up the camera, but no. we went to Soho after I got a massage, which was like 10 out of 10. I enjoyed it so much. Highly recommend. Um, the talks in New York City and then we went to Soho and shopped and shopped literally all day We got so much good stuff. Maybe I could show I still don't have a dress <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I could show you guys a haul tomorrow morning when it's like light out because our room's really dark right now But then I had a wedding planning meeting my last oh. one and it took like an hour and 45 minutes I'm So we really missed stressed about it. <laughs> we missed our first <laughs> Dinner reservation. So the next available option was 9 45 at Nobu because so I've now... been craving sushi so now it's 9.45 and we're going to eat dinner. And I'm literally wearing the exact same outfit I wore last night, but like, who cares? No, you're not. Mom, I literally am, but I'm wearing a white shirt. shirt. I have a new outfit on. Do you want to show them? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is this on the right setting? Mom's first Nobu experience, what do you think? It was delicious. We had literally, you guys, like a full course meal. We had, well, we didn't have drinks, but we had um, appetizers, sushi, and then we had we finished with these donuts, donuts caramel and ice cream. with vanilla gelato. It was so good. So now we're so full. We're gonna go back to the room. 10 out of 10. 10, out of 10. We love Nobu. I love sushi, it's my now favorite. Lay down sleep. Yeah, my stomach so high, I don't button my pants. <laughs> and just got a coffee and walked around Central Park. It was really nice. And then we went into the Plaza Hotel. Um, 
when we were younger we used to like kind of grow up coming here more often than obviously we do now and we used to go to the plaza food hall and like eat and we would walk on the hotel and stuff it was so fun and we just went back and looked at the hotel and stuff and they closed the food hall since he said it's been closed for two years so it's been closed since covid and it makes me sad because we were like wanted to go in there and like live down there but it's like so different now but we just got back up to the room uh we have a dress fitting today at two i'm gonna try to film more while we're in there but it's just hard because obviously i don't want you guys to see the dress but i might like try to blur out some of the content just so you guys can like see and hear what we're doing because it is like super exciting and then we just came up from the lobby i bought a huge candle from the lobby i'm obsessed with the smell of this hotel and so i got this big mama and i'm gonna put it in my bedroom it's just like the most relaxing scent and it's a big three wick candle it smells so good <laughs> i wanted to show you some of the things that i bought yesterday super quick like do a little haul and i'll link them below in the description i got some really cute things from aloe yoga i'm actually wearing a set that i got um yesterday i'm obsessed with it i got a large in the pants and then a small in this like little cropped crew it's like the best like it's a really nice thin material and i absolutely love it so um i'll link for you guys it's called the high waist taylor sweatpant and then the cropped taylor crew neck pullover and i got small and large let me grab what else i got the cutest skirt i feel like i've been wanting this since last season i wanted it in black but i saw it in store in white and i feel like they're always sold out online hopefully they restocked but i got this in a size medium and it's this really cute little tennis skirt for summer i thought this would be fun with like slides or sneakers or anything like that and then like a little sports bra i went to aloe to try to get this certain style bra top i'll also link it because i'm gonna place an order online and order it because they were sold out of my size but i got that and then i got some other like little random things um from like little local stores that i wouldn't be able to link so i'm like why show you guys will see them on like instagram stuff i got some like vintage levi shorts and then some cute dresses and stuff for the honeymoon so we had a little shopping day yesterday. Today is about the dress, and then we're gonna um, go to like Sephora or maybe like a Saks or something like that and get my wedding day perfume. I think I've picked out the one that I wanna get, but I'm not exactly sure. And then I'm gonna probably get Dylan a new one too because I just want us each to have like new ones, like a new scent for the day of the wedding, and then also um, for like the flat lay photos and things like that. So we're gonna get dressed. Mom's gonna go take a photo of me. I'm gonna put like a cute little skirt on and stuff, but then I'll probably change because I don't wanna walk around like in an uncomfy outfit. I feel like comfort is key here, especially if you're gonna be walking. So just wanted to update. This is the last full day in New York. Okay, I just got dressed. I'm wearing this little all white outfit. The top is from Revolve skirt. This is like super old. I got this last summer off Revolve. I think that they might have it and it might be on sale and then these boots are from Dolce Vita we're gonna go take a cute little photo in the street and then I'm gonna be extra and come change into a comfy outfit to walk to the dress place because I feel like this is just not practical to walk a mile in thank you you too thanks we're out of almond. Got a coffee. I'm trying Ralph's coffee for the first time. We're walking to the dress place for the second fitting. And I got an ice smell latte. <laughs> We're back. We're back, day two. Last day of fitting. So then we pick the dress up tomorrow. And then we get married in like seven days. <laughs> Here's the dress. She's in here. <laughs> We're waiting, she's doing like two more little tucks to the side. We're gonna try it on again and I think we're gonna be good to go. It was like perfect. Perfect. <laughs> um, yeah, I think it's like getting gonna get cooler. We're just down the street, but are we gonna walk after that? Yeah. Um, we came back to the room to drop some bags. We did a little more shopping. We got Danny a Lego set from Lego World. <laughs> I feel like we're doing more touristy things this trip because we're staying yeah. at Central Park. Last time we stayed in Soho, which was so fun, but the dress place is on Fifth Ave, which is like a touristy 
street it's where all the shopping is it's where like the plaza central park like all of that fun stuff so it's been kind of fun because i actually haven't seen any of this stuff since i was in like middle school because last time we literally just stayed in soho but we did go to Saks on the way back and i got my wedding perfume which i'm really excited about i'm going to show you guys it because honestly he hooked me up with the samples so i got and he sprayed the bag with the perfume and it smells so good um i don't know how you say it killian killian love by killian don't be shy i'm not gonna take it out of the thing because i have to travel with it but i'll link this perfume it's a more i'm like so bad at describing scents but it's more of like a sweet it's infused with like marshmallow and then like florals so it's like a sweeter light airy perfume i feel like it'll be perfect for the beach i love my um baccarat i think that's what it's called which is like the best smelling perfume probably still my favorite over this one but i've been wearing that and i wanted like a different scent for the wedding day so i got this and i love it mom i don't think that you well yeah you might need a blazer wear my cream one i have my i have this one. Oh, okay Look, we're gonna go what you were thinking of that I think it would be cute, but then you would have to wear a different color shirt. Yeah, that looks better. Yeah, I just think it was funny. I was like... But they're getting better. I just was messing with them. Don't mess with them. I know. I need to stop. But I just put my moisturizer on. I'm going to put that medicine on them. Yeah. But it is drying up. But what time is it? It's bedtime. 9.15. We've been in the room for like 30 minutes now. But we went back to the same restaurant we went to the first night. Rue 57 or is it 52? 57. 57 and had dinner it was so yummy and i think we're just tired it's been like a long two days and so we're just chilling in the room enjoying the room because it's such a cute nice hotel we check out tomorrow around um we were originally supposed to go back to the wedding dress store and pick up the dress and we were going to actually bring it with us on the airplane but we decided to just overnight ship it so they have the dress we don't have to go back so the dress is all good we're all good to go with that so tomorrow we actually have nothing besides just the flight which is later in the evening because we thought we would have to go to the dress store all that stuff um but it's supposed to be really bad weather so we're praying that both of us make it out of here <laughs> and don't get delayed and stuff we already got emails saying that there's a possible chance that our flights could get canceled because there's like really bad weather coming in so fingers crossed that we don't that would really suck we'll miss the wedding because <laughs> the wedding's so close People are probably like, literally, why are you getting your dress altered three days before the wedding? <laughs> I'm wondering why. <laughs> yeah, I would say I don't recommend, but honestly, at the same time, I do recommend because she fit it so perfectly oh, to my yeah. body that it's going to fit me. Like, I, I don't feel stressed about losing weight, gaining weight, no. like, nothing like that. So, um, anyways. we ate a hell of a dinner. Yeah, because we made good food this <laughs> trip, so, whatever. Um, but yeah, I'll pick the camera back up tomorrow when we wake up but we're just in the hotel and probably gonna watch the new episode of the kardashians no i'm going to bed but i don't i can watch it on my phone oh my god <laughs> mom you are not going to bed at 9 15. i am too I'm you just going... took your sleep gummies <laughs> yeah look at mom and i in the robes <laughs> okay night <laughs> <laughs> mom's making a coffee last morning and we're heading out and it's like disgusting rain outside i just walked over to a coffee shop it's literally right down there i got two lattes i got a little cheese danish and some yogurt See if their coffee's good. Mom, I got you a cheese Danish. Nice. Cause I know you like those from Starbucks. And I got you a coffee in case you wanted an iced one. I can get the straw. Mmm. This might be the best coffee I've had the trip. Nice. I should have been going down there every day. Oh, I forgot a spoon. Sometimes. All right, we're out of here. We are out of here. <laughs> cool. 
My carry-on bag is literally so heavy. And I know my suitcase is overweight because I came here with it at 51 pounds and I feel like I bought a lot of stuff. So, it's good. We're going to go try to drop our bags for like an hour while we go grab lunch. I literally have on so many layers because I was trying to make my luggage not overweight, but I think it still is. Anyways. Anyways. Anyways.